Welcome back to the channel. Today we're heading down to downtown Summerlin to check out the farmer's market. So come get lost with us today. And if you like Las Vegas content, make sure to subscribe. Let's get to it. So if you're staying at Red Rock for the weekend, this might be an option. It is right across the way from Red Rock. And if you want to see our complete tour of Red Rock, make sure to click up in that upper right hand corner. Let's get to that farmer's market. So there's Lazy Dog. If you want to see us eat there, check out the video in the upper right hand corner. But here is the outside of downtown Summerland. Nice little shopping area. Also, if you want to see our full tour of that, we'll also have one of those in the comments as well as in the upper right hand corner. Let's go find that farmer's market. If you're looking for the farmer's market, it's underneath the big old canopy area next to the Bassett, the Aveda, and the Five Star Sitters. Let's go under there and see what it looks like. spreads out and then goes this way all the way over there and then all the way down here so you can bring your pups to the farmers market there's a bunch of dog friendly areas in this uh, section it's so cute so there's the rest of the farmers market it's pretty big. So if you want another idea where this is, there's Public School 702. You can check out that video in the upper right hand corner. But there's a play area right here. And then it's on the other side of that play area is the farmer's market. Let's go check the other side out. All right, so there's some baked goods, some beauty products, some cleaners, some veggies. There's an animal table. There's some baked goods some clothing. It's a fascinating flea market. So another area, it's right by this big lawn area where they have their shows and stuff. If you're watching some of our previous videos, the, it's right over here. And so there's pom -poms. There's a ton of people in this little area. It kinda gets crowded here in all honesty. It's kinda crazy. The bread booth down there does look super tasty. And they got some other stuff. Alright, so here's the one way. It's pretty packed, as you say. A bunch of different booths. There's a handmade popsicle thing. And there's a big fruit and vegetable stand. And there's some other stuff down there. Pretty big. And the other side. So it's not super big. It's not really small, but it's not. It's one little street underneath the Cenador. Now the benefit is even in summertime, there is underneath a tented area. So it will cool it down some, but it's still gonna be pretty warm.
beef jerky, some juices. Pretty cool. So this is kind of the main area with the produce. There's a lot of produce here. There's some stuff down there. Is the other side. All right, so that concludes our tour of downtown Summerlin's Farmer's Market. Uh, first thing is it's really small. Uh, in comparison to the other farmer's markets I've been to, it's not very big at all. My favorite part was honestly all the puppies walking around and getting to pet those. It was pretty awesome. There's a lot of different stuff there. There's some fresh fruits, there's some dog treats, bath bombs, and a wide assortment of things, but not much of quantities. So you're looking at a bunch of different booths, but not very much at each booth. And there's not very many booths. It's basically one street long uh, with two little side areas. Probably take you at most 10 minutes to walk, if that, if you go really slow. Uh, again, there's not much here. Would I recommend coming off the strip to come here? No. But if you're a local and looking for some fresh produce or maybe looking for a local business, it's an opportunity to come by and stop. They are open on Saturdays from 9 a.m. till 2 p.m. Uh, and that's it. So it's not open very long and there's not much here. But if you're a local, it might be worth a try. So if you like this video, hit that thumbs up. Make sure to hit that subscribe button and ring that notification bell so you get notified when we do at least three videos a week. And we'll come and get you for the next one. And as Macy likes to say, ain't that the truth, baby Ruth? Bye, everybody.